gonna make room. Those who are seated on the benches. At this time, you're gonna collect God's money. Bless the name of Praise the Lord. Dun, 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 dun. 
God prophesied to me and tell me, say, when time a picnic start, give me a problem. We must not get fed up. Lord Jesus, not even two weeks pass. I will just stop me from here, boy. I say, remember, sir, Pastor, when tell us, say, we must not get problem. That's true. I get problem to you and tell me, say, no, God, don't even say, come out of my house. Not even, not even an explanation has spread in there, come out. Because if no God to them. And him said, no, I tell you, say, remember, say, I call to you, say, Pastor, say, church, praise God. So it start to give me a problem. Amen. Come on, church of God. I said, not, not even two weeks after, the problem start. So we have to just take the problem. Because the man of God said, remember, say, we also give a problem. So we have to take the problem. Shall I praise God? Tonight, if anyone, anyone have, if ever want somebody, must have a testimony tonight. Oh. Shall we praise the Lord? Shall we praise the Lord? Tonight I'm truly grateful to be in the house of the Lord tonight. Praise God. New Year's Eve, that would be last year. The man of God prophesied that this year is my year. Shall we praise the Lord? Shall we praise the Lord? Bless the name of Jesus. Saints of God, I get also living and free. I don't pay a water rate. I don't pay a light bill. I don't even pay an internet bill. Bless the Lord. Bless the Lord. I get the land. Bless the name of Jesus. My son is going to a tradition high school. Bless the Lord. I get called to go overseas to work. Shall we praise the Lord? Shall we magnify the name of Jesus? Saints of God, I'm telling you. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. You are in the house of liberty. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. I'm telling you. I, I love this testimony and I, I, I just love to give it because I want to lift somebody feed. You know, my right leg should be cut off on the 6th of January last year. And when the doctor, even now I do not open that envelope to show you how much I trust God. Bless the name of Jesus. And I said I have a prophet in the house. And when I went to service, that healing service at Tuesday night. And when I went there, I find a man, he was on the floor. And he closed his eyes and he gave me a bottle of water, saints of God. My feet, it was spoiling. It was pure slime running out of it. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. When I have to sleep at night time, I have to tie my foot up in the ceiling because I cannot bear the pain when I hang it down. Bless the Lord. Bless the Lord. I'm not telling you, saints of God, when I use that bottle of water to suck the feet in the night. Can I talk to your church? In the morning, my feet start to dry up. I just want somebody to magnify the name of Jesus, you know. I just want somebody to trust in God, you know. Oh, bless the name of Jesus because he is not so concerning his blessing. Shall we praise the Lord? So tonight, saints, I want you to give the prophet your hand and give God your heart. Bless the Lord. When you get a prophecy yes. and it work for your boss time, yes. shall I praise the Lord? Praise the Lord. You know, the reason why you know I work for some people because you still don't believe the man of God. Right so you get the prophet, the prophecy, but you don't believe. Shall I praise God? We still have more testimony. Praise God, we still shout out 5,000. We bless the Lord. Lord. We bless the Lord another time. Lord. First, I must greet God, the man of my life, then to my worthy apostle. From the rustum to the pew, accept and I greetings. Surely I can say God has been good to me. I can't complain. No, it was about last month. No, school started in September. It was about in July, the apostle. I was in church and he pointed at me and he said, stand up. So I stood up and he said, just start magnifying the Lord. And I did just that. And then he said to me, a breakthrough is going to come for your little daughter. Just worship God as it comes. And saints, I listened and I obeyed. My daughter, she is a teacher, special aid teacher. 
So she was working at Nakalva first, but that job was for six months. So she was substituting for a teacher that was on maternity leave. And then she got one, about four, after the apostle said that, she got about four calls for four different schools. And then, so she had to choose. She was confused and she said, what, which one should I choose? And she chose to go to Hopewell Eye. And at Hopewell Eye, she's not only a teacher, but she is a coach in the department that Love she is. Who could it be but Jesus? So you see, all we have to do is come to church, set up our spirit, listen to the man of God and exercise our faith, and the, prof the prophecy must come to a pass. Yes, I, I do. Worship the Lord. the Lord. Amen. This is a little short one. Amen. 2017, before we went on our family trip, Amen. Our, our pastor was in Waterworks in December. We went December, and he was in Waterworks in December. He prophesied to me, he said, see me going away, making some money, and come back. Amen. The prophecy has fulfilled in Jesus' name. I love Jesus. 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 To testify, I first me see put up here. So then go up and say, Daddy, we put me to testify, and the bishop will call me. Now. Sure, praise God. I don't know what his testimony is about, but I first me see, he say having testimony. Sure, praise the Lord. I don't know what the apostle prophesied to him, say, but he said, Daddy, I have my testimony. Sure, praise the Lord. Sure, praise the Lord. Come on, worship the Lord. You see, a person tell me that they, 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 they put up their star upon the crown. Shall I praise God? And as I said, he get a little job. And he first working work, he get paid last week at $10,000. Because he don't go to work for a few days. And I was sitting down in the church in the night when he come from work. But he never seen me come in, I dark sit down. And he called on my phone, they look for me there. In the walk down the whole place, look for me. So I said, Mr. Carrier, look for me for. Daddy, I get 10,000 for a peer, and I look for you 5,000 over time. <laughs> and he gave me 5,000 out of his $10,000. Shall I praise the Lord? Come on, worship the Lord. So I don't know what the apostle prophesied to him. But my, when he come back down there, he didn't gain testimony. Yeah. Shall I praise God? Yeah. One more testimony. Yeah. Come, sister. Yeah. All right. All right. Let me hear it, girl, my God. Yeah. Let me hear it, praise the Lord another yeah. time. Yeah. Um, I'm from Prospect. I don't know if much of you know. Yeah. I think it was in January of this year. We had a... I think it was a four-night convention and the apostle he was preaching that night and he came to me I was sitting on the second row and he came to me and he turned him back and said hmm, I'm sorry for you but I've got a hip right for you hey. I went on a seven-day fasting because I said God you know me the struggle and you know me fear and you know me the fight for Apostles are you for provide? Are you have to provide? Me want you for provide. Amen. Now my son was teaching a old man's boys. And let me tell you, he went to hell and back. And he applied at another school and the principal gave him a fight. He applied in Canada. He got a fight. And he applied, I think it was February in England for a teaching job. And let me tell you something. He got you in flying colors. Yeah. 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 
coming from work on Tuesday night. I think eating and prophecy service was keeping in Lanso that night. And uh, I was coming home from work, but I reached at a spot where I saw the church bus. And I asked them, where they are going? They said, I'm going to Lanso. They said, you are me come. And I went on the bus, and when I reached Lanso, I was standing at the door. You know, feeling tired and exhausted toward that 12 hours. I stand at the door and Apostle send Bishop McNeish come said something to me. And I didn't say anything about it. And when he tell Bishop McNeish, I was like, oh, God is really talking. Amen. Because he, he said that my wife, is a pregnancy. My wife was pregnant. And um, he said that he saw me going through some difficulties. And believe you me, I am going through the difficulties, but I trust God. Yes. You know, through all the difficulties, I trust God. Yes. He, he prophesied to my wife that you know for worry about the baby because God I got provide. Yes. And let me tell you something, while we're going through our difficulties, we didn't buy anything for the baby. Yes. Hallelujah. The baby get close, even yes. tire pass, everything yes. what the baby needs. <laughs> provide and throw up my difficulty and continue to worship God in spite of everything because I know he will provide. God bless you.
Is here already. Shall we praise God? Ooh. Our first speaker will be Reverend Mallory.
praise God, Apostle Foster Bishop Tingling, praise God, Elder, Elder Thompson, Pastor Thompson, all officers and members in the house, accept a night of greetings. Come on, shout hallelujah. hallelujah. Praise God, the time is far spent, but tonight I just come to tell somebody that if any at all you desire to see the face of God, then you must be a good steward. God bless you, God keep you, in Jesus' name. Why, 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 why?
is working. We're going to introduce the next speaker. Share praise God. Share praise God. We're going to bless the offering. Bless the day. Chakwa, yeah, 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 ye